Go. Okay, so here we are at our apartment. And we don't actually have a key, and that's why we're outside. What we do is we flip this up and we enter a code. It's over there. We don't want to look at the code. Okay. The door so the door opens up. And so that's how we get into our room. And then if you look at the floor down here, okay, it's marble. We aren't wearing shoes because we're inside, but normally we take off our shoes and leave them there, like those sandals are left there. And then when we shut the door, if you watch this, it actually clicks over and locks after a couple seconds, so that's really nice and handy. And then as I walk in here, you can look over here, and this is our shoe closet. So we have a closet just for shoes. It's very nice. It keeps it organized. It doesn't take up much space, and it rotates to holding more shoes. I really like it. So we close that, and then as we come over here, we have scarves, hats, iron, all that stuff. And then this is more storage. Now this is just as we're walking in, we have all this storage. Leon's really excited because there's badminton courts at our place. So we went and bought two badminton rackets and some birdies. So later today, uh, we'll actually take you outside and do an outside tour and we'll show you the badminton courts and probably bring our rackets down and hit a couple of the shuttlecocks. So. Come over here. This is our guest bathroom. So we have our toilet, a sink, a bathtub, which is exciting. We haven't used it yet. That looks kind of deep. We probably won't fit. And then this is our mirror. And there's Leon. Hi, Leon. And this is a clock so that we can tell the time, but it's not actually accurate right now. And then we open these up. This is all storage, this whole unit. So that's the guest bathroom. Turn off the light. And then we come in here, this is our guest bedroom, which we need to kind of fix up and make it look a little nicer. But for right now, it's great. Just a spare bed in here. We don't really use it. Come out through here. This is our balcony. And this is the first door. Uh, there's three doors to the balcony. So this is the far side of the balcony, and we actually have this, which we believe is to clean the floors. We haven't used it yet, and we have a drain. Leon's going to walk to the opposite end so you guys can see exactly how long the balcony is. I'm going to wave. Hi, guys. He's walking. Still walking. Okay, you are now at the end of the balcony, and he'll turn around and show you the shelving unit. Some shelves on the balcony. Now, as we come right out here, something smells really good outside, and Sam's gonna zoom in. And that tomato symbol is actually our school. So we're right across the street from our school. And as he pans down, you can see that there's different places to shop. And if you pan down even more, you can see that there's a trail that winds around. We believe that there's about eight different apartment buildings within our complex and within that there's this walking path that goes all the way around there's basketball courts badminton courts and a workout area and we are going to take you down and show you that later right in the distance is the mountain that me and Leon actually hiked up it's really cool and we'll definitely be posting more about the mountain if you come right in here this is our living room area so we have our dining room table, our futon. Leon's going to actually sit on the futon. So you can see how long our living room is. And we come over here. We have our little table, one chair. The other chair is by the vanity area. And we have all of our Korea tour books. Come over here. This is the kitchen. When we were deciding to move to Korea, I was kind of bummed because I figured I wouldn't have much kitchen space, but actually this kitchen is huge, so I'm really excited. So we have tons of counter space here, and then all of these drawers open up, and we have, you know, our pots and pans, our bowls, everything like that is in there. More storage space, these all open up. We'll show you this one, 
just because Grandma Janice's cookbook is there, so when I'm homesick, I can make some food. We have our coffee pot, which we actually went and bought today, and we're very excited because coffee's a dessert in Korea, and me and Leon need our coffee in the morning. Over here, we have our range, and then above our range, we have the hood, and the hood you just pull out, and it turns on the light and the fan. And then here we have an oven. Most Korean homes do not have an oven, so I'm very, very excited, and I feel very lucky to have one. We have our sink, and of course, we have my pink cleaning gloves. It's very exciting. Over here is more storage, and we believe this is for a microwave, which we don't have. If you come over here, we have our fridge, we have our workout schedule here, and then we have pictures of family members. And as you can see, Carl's, there's no pictures of you because no one gave me any before I left. So send them in the mail to me and I will be sure to put them on my fridge. We would love to have some pictures of Leon's side of the family. Over here, they left spam. So we have a big thing of spam and another big thing of spam. So apparently Koreans love their spam. We've seen it a lot of different places. And the people that used to live here, they left a bunch of stuff, which is really good because they left this fabric softener, which is good because, well, we can't read Korean and it already says softener, and detergent. So in through this door is actually our laundry room. So come on through. I have some laundry going at the moment. So this is our washing machine. And more storage over here. And then this is actually a pretty big room. It goes pretty far back. And that's our drying rack from the laundry that we did earlier. Come on through here. Oh, I'll show you my broom because this is, these are the brooms in Korea and I think they're really cute. So I'll show you both. We're a little too big for the broom. Come right on through here and I'll show you the guest bedroom. Another guest bedroom. I think right, we're going to turn this into an office space. Right now, there's really nothing in it, and there is a door out to the balcony area, so that's another door. Okay, and then we'll come out here, and this is our bedroom. It's our bed. We don't really have a comforter yet, and nor do we need one because it's very hot and humid right now in Korea. Leon's showing you his computer right now. He has it all set up until we get the office area set up. It feels very cool. If you come out here, th Leon, come on. He likes his computer. If you come out here, this is an, our own personal balcony. So that's a little bigger balcony that other people could go to. And this is the balcony just for the master suite. And we have a view, again, of across the street, our school. And those other big buildings are actually apartments. And I don't know if you guys can see, but there's a ladder there. And that's actually how they move in. So you rent this ladder, and then it takes stuff up to the upper floors of buildings. And that's how they move in their furniture and everything like that. So that's how you move in in Korea, is a big ladder. And we come over here, show you the master bath. So I really, really, really like our bathroom. So we have the mirrors here. I bought this. This is a little hippo and it's an air freshener. So you push it and it actually lets out air fresh. Over here we have a toothbrush holder that looks like a giraffe and I thought it was cute. And then we have my trash can that looks like a bear. Oh, bear. Over here is the shower, and I absolutely love my shower. It is huge, and we have one of the rain shower heads, which is my absolute favorite. We'll walk out here, and we will show you the rest of our master suite. Leon wants to show you his computer again. And over here, we have my vanity area where I get ready. A huge mirror on the opposite side. Nice mirror. Oh, look, there's another mirror. Hmm. 
Oh, wait. Wait for it, people. Wait for it. Huge closet. Yay, big closet. I really like the closet, and we have room if we wanted to. And if Korean clothes fit us, to buy even more clothes, and it would still fit. I don't think that's ever happened for me. So come over here. There's another private balcony for the master suite. Lots of storage. And on the opposite side is even more storage. As we come out here, you can actually see the outside. And we'll actually do uh, another video of the outside of our complex just because we think it's really interesting and that they have a lot of stuff for the people that live in the apartments. Okay, that's our place. And we'll talk to you later. Bye.